Hello guys, and as you can see, I've fixed the glitch. No, now there's, you know, the water ain't glitching anymore. Because if, anyway, if, you, <clears throat> if you're uh, coming from, well, if you're, I don't know how to start this, <laughs> lol, but um, if you haven't seen part one, uh, in part one, essentially my, uh, my, uh, my shadows were really glitchy because of my any folder. Uh, and just looking at the water, it looks so nice. Just okay. So now we can get started. Last time I was in Markarf, I just picked up a quest. Now I want to actually go do the quest. Just want to figure out. Yeah. So you got the Forsworn Conspiracy. I'm not sure where that would lead to. I'll do. I'm not going to do that right now. I want to. Just want to figure out where this is. Okay. <coughs> Our chief. Lizbet Shipman from the Red Eagle Red Red Redoubt Redoubt. I don't know how that's pronounced. But anyway. Um let's see. Actually get my dagger out for now. Since I'm so low on Magicka. Gimme. Yum 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 yum. <laughs> yes, I know my stamina is low. Oh my god, stupid tutorial garbage. Oh, silver. Nice. But I don't have a pickaxe. Nope. So. Okay. So, so I'd have to go down this river, actually. I may as well go on the road. Hey, wait, I have a lockpick. Let's just steal these eggs. Nice. And, um... <clears throat> so let's... Ah! I only have one attempt. <laughs> oh my god, I was so close. Now, I'm not going to steal anything that I, oh, pickaxe that I can use. I'm only going to steal stuff that's directly useful to me. I'm not going to, like, I'm not going to steal that wine and try to resell it, because I won't be able to. Oh, I'll steal this, uh, this stuff right here. That's useful. Uh, oh, still these potatoes. And this ca cabbage. I was like, this ca 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 cabbage. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> still these potatoes. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Hello. Random chicken. You don't mind if I kill you. Chicken breast, thank you. So on this let's play, I'm not really a, a nice character, nor am I a really bad character. It's just I, I am willing to kill people. Actually, let me get my, my flame spell on this guy. There we go. No, but uh, like I was saying, this character, I'm not really a nice guy, but I'm not really a mean guy. It's just that I am willing to kill people to get uh, to get started.
Gimme. Nom nom nom. Actually, there was that silver up there. I'll get it when I come back, actually. Oh, yes! There's an ore vein over there. gonna go in there. I'm kind of uh, I'm kind of weak right now, so. I kind of feel as strong as a hobo right now. <laughs> Oh, nice. Nightshade. Come on! Give me your pelt, bitch. I could hear Nurnroot. There's a new route. Oh, there it is. Gimme. I might as well go inside this river and look for some. Gimme, oh, gimme. Where is he? Just flew away. Cunt. Also, there's a glitch when I go underwater. The the whole sort of screen turns greenish. Yeah, you see. Come on. If you spam the button like that, you actually use a lot less magic than if you were to hold it. Where is it? Oh my god, what a troll! Look at that, it's underneath the environment. They didn't even bother to place it, they just had some sort of auto-generate tool that it just placed it there. Or maybe they had someone else just wasn't looking and when they, when they placed it they sort of forgot about the actual person uh, coming to change the terrain I guess. That must be so frustrating for someone on console who's like looking for where the hell it where the hell it is and like you just can't find it and you can't go TFC underneath the the environment and see if there's something there that you can't reach. Oh gimme.
let's just go uh, discover that so I can come back here and clear that out when I get the time. Get owned. So it's not a, it's not actually a cave, I think, or a fort. Let's uh, just mine this stuff up, like Minecraft. <laughs> Doesn't it? It kind of reminds you of Minecraft, but you're not actually digging deep underground. Okay, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Let me. All right. Well, I could um, could just keep my trying to dodge his attacks. Awesome. <laughs> What are they worth? Wow, those Forsworn axes are worth a lot. I mean, for a beginner, that is. not Maybe not for a, an advanced uh, character, but for the beginning, not a beginner, that's not bad. Oh, so is it this cave? No, it's over there. Um, is it? No, it's, it's real confusing right now. It's that's weird.
So is it over here or what? Yeah, it's over here. I think. See, it says that it's over there, but it's, I'm, okay, I'm actually over here, but... I better actually save my magic for uh, spells. <clears throat> Come on, stupid loading screen. Yeah, regenerate my magic up before I, I get going again. This really sucks. I uh, all right. I'll try to sort out, but um, I'm trying to stick, stay away from. Oh, that works. That's a big plus right there. Now our novice, our novice uh, magic costs half the magic uh, to use, so it's gonna go a, lo a lot better now.
Where is that trap? I just stepped on a trap. Ah, oh, it's hidden inside the bushes. Oh, come on, you stupid troll. I can't see shit. gonna save because I really feel insecure about this place. Oh nice, magic of potion. Is this even where I'm supposed to be going? <laughs> oh, okay, I think I see. I think I understand now. See, we're going up there, but the entrance is over here, so I had to go like that. Okay, now I see. I'll have to come back later with, uh, with more space. Um, <laughs> not really. gonna take their cure asses. No, that's not what I want. Oh my god, this interface. It's really fucking annoying, this interface. Oh, nice. I'm just trying to make my magicka go as far as it can. Too much. I'll drop all these boots for now. Because if you check the actual boots, it weigh as much as a headdress, but a headdress is worth 50. And one and uh, the other thing that it has a really good weight to gold ratio is the uh, <coughs> the, uh, the actual cuirass of the Forsworn armor. Oh, actually, I'm gonna save just in case I screw this up, because I've only got one luck pick.
Uh, let me reload. All right. Wow, I actually got it. I, I was pretty certain after after a few fails there that it was going to pretty much break me my pick. GTFO, man. Yeah. Wow. I'm going to have to bring out my sword. We gotta kill that mage first. Then they're both mages. <laughs> Power attack to the face, bitch. Where'd it go? Seriously, this is like a buttload of these guys. Uh, let's try to bow out. Again, using the one hand technique. That way you can stretch your magicka for as long as possible. It doesn't really change that much, but it does sometimes give you that extra little second that you need to uh, to, ki to uh, recharge all your, your magicka or sometimes to kill a guy or whatever. Wow, what a fail! How much weight capacity have I got? I'll probably have to come back and get a lot of their loot. But anyway, let's, uh, is it here or is it on the top? Yeah, I think it's, uh, up top.
<laughs> That's what happens when you're when you're a bitch. Oh yeah, so I can level up. All right. Uh, put it into Magicka, and so for destruction, what can I get for destruction? The dual casting perk. I'll take that. I don't have any other perks to use right now. How far am I from leveling up? Okay, I'm a good ways from leveling up. You see me weaving and dashing all the time, that's just because I'm trying to dodge their arrows. Holy shit! Just gotta get it to the point where he can't one-shot me. What's that? Briar Heart. Oh, nice. Yeah, these Forsworn four swords aren't bad to start with. So that's all of our shipment. Shipment. All right, I'm actually gonna. Ha um, I don't think I have enough uh, weight capacity. What I'll do is at least I'll just drop. I'll drop a few stuff stuffs behind. <laughs> and let's see. Yeah. Okay. And then I'll come back. Uh, let's just make sure I've actually discovered the location. I have. Okay. And then, let's just uh, place a marker so I know that it's there that I have to go. Now let's go back to Markarth and solve some stuff. And uh, also not just solve some stuff, but actually complete the quest. Oh! Oh my gosh, it's closed. Let's see. Oh, I may as well go sleep for the night. Come on in. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of str This is the Silver Blood Inn. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Take a look. What? I just clicked on rent a room. Stupid ass interface. Oh my god, I'm raging over this interface. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Yes, someone indeed stole my sweet roll. Let's see those storm cloaks try to break into this canyon. Arnleaf. No, I'm not Arnleaf. Oh, there it is. This little gold delight is going to keep us afloat for a while. Thank you. Here's something for your hard work. Oh, nice. 500 gold. Some may call this uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna sell you a bunch of crap that you probably don't need. <laughs> I pro I think I have, like, way too much stuff, like, for her to buy everything. I don't think she's actually gonna be able to buy everything. Damn, Forsworn Bow is, like, fucking beast. So the hunting bow does like 8 damage, and the force one bow does like 13. <laughs> so trash.
so loud, I don't need that. Um, yeah, she can't. This is so useful. You can actually tell how much you're selling, so you don't have to count it yourself. I mean, like the, the actual value. I cleaned you of your stuff, bitch. <laughs> uh, so now I can probably buy those robes, I think. Oh, nice. That's, oh, well, I mean, it increases your magicka by 20 points, but I'm not going to spend that much for that. Uh, yeah. I could either take this or take this. I think either way, they're both going to help me. Like, they're, I think I'm going to take the one with, for the restoration. Because it's cheaper. Because I'm, uh, I'm like that. <laughs> that's going to be, that's going to be useful for, uh, restoration. So I'm just going to buy one of those. Now I need to sell a lot of crap to, uh, get my money back. Oh yeah, that reminds me, um, um, oops, all that. Ah, oh, she's like, not giving me any value on that one. Let's see. I want to turn all my ores into, uh, into ingots before I actually sell the uh, ores because I'll be losing value on those items. There's still a fucking glitch. I need to get a, a fix for that. It's like Bethesda doesn't even bother to make this game properly without any glitches because they know all the modders are just gonna fix all the glitches themselves. So we could go inside of there and get all the stuff. Could we? I'm not sure how much uh, stuff there is down there. If I can get any. Ah, uh, okay, prisoners. Well. Bitch. I thought I would have been able to uh, to get some stuff. There's a small skiver then just east of the city at Reachwater Rock. I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a belly full of meat. I oversee Markarth's small work. Worker gets out of line, I get him back in time. Look at you. I'm some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Wow, she's really not giving me much e um <laughs> I said I was I almost said EMC, but she's not giving me very much uh, value on that. Actually I may as well keep it for when I have um more uh, more skill uh, for that. Alright. I just want to buy some potions. 
if she does have any. Alright. Come back whenever you need something. The selection seems I inherited the store from my husband. His father was Arun Lake. My husband, Gunnar, died about five years ago. For sworn attack. I miss that stubborn note. No, as if trade wasn't poor enough. Now there's violence in the streets. It was the Forsworn, wasn't it? I lose dozens of shipments every season to those barbarians. Now they're in the city? God help us. Oh yeah, and uh, I had a bunch of crap to, um, to go get at uh, that Forsworn camp. Actually, no. Um, let's. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna end the recording before I start the next. Uh, the next recording. I'm gonna go clear out that. Uh, that stuff. Uh, that I. All those uh, things I wanted to loot, at that Forsworn camp, and then we'll get on with another quest when. Uh, when I get back. So as usual, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, uh, click the like button and the subscribe button. Uh, hopefully I can actually make something out of this channel. I don't know. Um, but <coughs> anyway, I'm really, to be honest with you, I'm just doing this for fun. But um, yeah. So if you liked it, again, just click the subscribe button and you get all of these in your inbox. That sounds familiar. <laughs> well, um... So yeah, I gotta go do that, and I'm also gonna set this to upload. So, uh, see you guys.